Welcome to my channel. So we're going to program our FT5D using RT systems and the SD cards. So we've already formatted the SD card in my PC. We now put it into the FT5. Hold down F menu. Scroll to SD card. Tap that and then we're going to format it. Uh, make sure you've got a backup if you need one. So it will format. And this is putting on well, this is going to help prepare the SD card for our RT systems software. So that's done. And then we'll scroll back up to where it says backup. Click F menu. And then we'll go right to SD card. If we can push F menu again, turn the channel knob, click OK. Okay, now our radio is ready for us to remove the SD card, and of course, it's recommended that you turn it off. So we'll do that and take out the SD card, which is a bit fiddly with my hands. Okay, and it comes out this way here. And we'll put that into an adapter into our laptop we're using in this case, and it will open a new window and show you the files that you've got. These have all been put in by the, you know, by form formatting and backing up your radio. So that's all good, looking fine in your USB drive. Let's minimize that. So now, now remember, you should have at this point already put your call sign into your radio. So go file, then new. You've got a new file now. Now we're going to read from that card. So we'll go communication, read from SD card, and then click OK. So that's what's on there now, and now we can make our changes. So let's add our hotspot first. Down to at number four, we'll go four, four, let me think now, four, three, eight, dot, five, seven, five, that's the one I use a lot. It's a simplex. So there's no offset we're using, so we change that to simplex. And it's digital, digital narrow, and we'll name it hotspot. We'll put in the things I use the most, and then we'll bring in some repeaters. So my all-star node is 434.550. Again, it's simplex. Now, if you, I'll show you how to add a repeater as well anyway. So there's no offset. It is FM. It's my hubnet node, put hubnet, and there is a tone of 77 that we use to access that. So that's all in there. Now the next thing we'll do is we'll want to bring in some repeaters. So what we're going to do is go file, external data, go to repeater book, and we're just going to say that I'm in Bristol for now, and we'll do 30 miles. We're only going to choose 2 meter and 70 repeaters. Click OK. And it's now given us all these repeaters, which is very handy. And what we're going to do is create file for FT5D here at the bottom. We're going to click that so we can use that. And then we want to copy and paste this. So one way is to hold your mouse here and pull it down like so to the bottom one, right click, copy, you could do control C, and then we'll go back to our first window, because every time you read on RT systems, it opens a new window. So we'll go back to our first window, which is here, we'll click here, number six, we'll right click and we'll paste, or you can go control V. Okay, now send that to the SD card and put it back in the radio. So we'll go communication, right to SD card. Then it says it's completed, we'll click OK, and then we're gonna remove it from the computer. Put it back in the SD card, or in the radio, should I say. Gold facing forward, it's a bit fiddly. Let's turn it on. Now let's read, so we'll go F menu, SD card, backup, 
read SD card. Push F menu, turn the channel knob to the left so it highlights OK in white. Click OK. And now it's reading and let's see if we've got those memory channels in there. Let's go to BFO and start looking. So they are, there's my all-star node. Not sure that's turned on at the moment. It is. And that will be my hotspot. No activity at the moment. And then you've got all those repeaters that we just added. And there's, that's it for now. So I hope this helps you use RT systems to program memory channels and repeaters. Bye for now. 7-3, all the best.